During the start of the decade, Apple surprised everyone by announcing a mini version of the iPhone for the very first time. The iPhone 12 mini came with a 6 inch OLED display aptly named Super Retina XDR, a whole 2 inches more than the iPhone 5 in 2013 and a 2815 milliamp battery. Despite demands to introduce a smaller version of the iPhone, sales of both the 12 and 13 mini were disappointing. The iPhone 12 mini in the US accounted for only 6% of overall sales of the entire 12 lineup. A year later, the 13 mini accounted for only 3% of the overall 13 lineup. Suffice to say, no one wanted the Mini. But why is this? Well, there are many reasons. The first is smaller smartphones aren't as desirable as they once were. When the original iPhone was launched, it had a 3.5 inch display that customers could easily hold in the palm of their hands and use one-handed. The battery life varied between 6 to 8 hours on a single charge. The demand for bigger iPhones began to grow in 2014 as Android began developing smartphones with taller displays. Hence the name Fablet becoming a widespread noun. It turns out the biggest trade-off with the Mini was its smaller battery, contributing to a disappointing battery life. The 12 Mini's lithium battery had 20% less milliamps than the iPhone 12. And so paying an extra £120 for the 12 proved to be worth it for many people as they'd have a bigger battery and display. The two biggest reasons why people buy iPhones in the first place. Consider how we use our phones today. We require a battery that can withstand various power intensive tasks without any compromise to battery life. Charging our phones more than once a day can be considered a deal breaker for many people. This is what ultimately led to the Mini's downfall. Apple may consider releasing the Mini again. However, customers may only be tempted if performance and battery life is equal to its slightly taller sister. But for now, the odds of that happening are slim to none. So that is why Apple ditched the Mini. Thanks for watching and I will see you in my next video.